I drew my sword and fell into Wind's stance, my most practiced stance. And the one you showed to Adara, I reminded myself. I shook my head in disbelief. I can't believe I showed her my favorite stance. I recalled showing off to her in the courtyard, using my expert ability to impress her. I cut through the air harsher than I should have, throwing myself off balance and forcing the next set of thrusts into a frenzy with little control. I calmed myself, leveling my sword and stilling my breath. I can't believe I showed her anything. I leapt into the next set of motions, moving through them like a drunkard sings his favorite song. I tripped, staggering through the movements, then tripped again, tossing my sword forward so I didn't impale myself. Adara's voice cut through my practice. You'll never be faster than my wit, Emriel, she whispered seductively. I growled, retrieving my sword and beginning the stance from the start. Front to back, I danced it perfectly, instilling fury and hatred into each swing. I envisioned her face with each slash, pushing myself further and further, rushing my way through anger into hatred. But the last swing of the stance fell, and when I envisioned her face the final time, I threw my sword forward with fright. Just as she'd done when we danced with our swords. I looked at Starfall with pity. You should be better than this, I thought. I scoffed at the thought of being frightened by her. I scoffed again as our memories rushed through my mind. I can't believe I shared a kiss with her. More than a kiss, I reminded myself. You wanted her. You were actually fine with marrying her. You convinced yourself that she was your future. 